Hey guys, for today's project we're going to be making aromatherapy scrubs and aromatherapy is more than just good smelling plant oils. It's made to help produce certain feelings of well-being and help influence your emotions in a certain direction. So we'll be making three different aromatherapy scrubs that focus on different areas. So one's going to be more restorative and for relaxation and another's going to be for uplifting, another for energizing. So let's go ahead and head into the kitchen and we'll get making our aromatherapy scrubs. All right guys, for this first recipe, we're making an uplifting coconut vanilla lime body scrub. I'm gonna start with drying out some lime zest and it's up to you however many limes you wanna use. It just depends on how much zest you wanna make. So I'm using four limes and I just use a small side of my grater and I'll just grade that and then I'll spread it over a baking sheet. I do have some parchment paper on there too and just pop it in the oven for about 20 minutes at 200 or a, just a very low heat setting and I did stir the zest about halfway through baking, but you just want it to bake long enough to be able to dry out all of that zest and make sure there's no moisture left in it. All right, so we'll need a mixing bowl, fine ground sea salt, a carrier oil, I'm using Manoi Tiki Tahiti, it's vanilla infused coconut oil, and then sweet lime essential oil and a glass mason jar. So I'll start by adding about one cup of sea salt to my mixing bowl. And then the carrier oil, I'm going to add two to three tablespoons. It just depends on how you like the texture of your scrub. And then just mix those together. And then we can add our sweet lime essential oil. I'm adding 20 drops of sweet lime essential oil. And just mix your ingredients. And here's a close up of the texture. So I do like to have mine a little bit on the lighter, fluffier side. So it's a little bit on the drier side of a scrub. And then we can add in our lime zest. And so you can add however much you want. And adding lime zest is completely optional, so don't feel like you have to use it in this recipe. It's just kind of a fun extra that gives the scrub kind of a festive, fun, pretty look. For our next aromatherapy scrub, we're making an energizing grapefruit body scrub. For this recipe, I'm using Himalayan pink sea salt, but I only have the large crystal sea salt, so I'm gonna have to grind this up and make it more fine. And then for carrier oil, I'm using sweet almond oil, and then I'm using grapefruit essential oil. So I'm adding about one cup of the Himalayan pink sea salt to my mixing bowl, and then about two tablespoons of sweet almond oil. I'm gonna mix those together and then add about 20 drops of grapefruit essential oil. And then just finish mixing in your essential oil and then scoop into your mason jar or whatever glass jar you're using to store your scrub. going to be making a restorative and relaxing lavender body scrub. For this recipe I'll be using sea salt and I only had the coarse sea salt so I ground it down so it'd be more finely milled. We'll also be using rice bran oil which is an ancient Japanese skincare secret and I'll be using lavender essential oil and dried lavender buds are optional. So I'm adding one cup of sea salt to my mixing bowl and about two tablespoons of rice bran oil and just mix those together. And then I'll sprinkle in some of the dried lavender flowers. And again, this is completely optional. I just happened to find this jar at TJ Maxx for only a couple of bucks. So I picked it up to use in recipes. And then I'll add 20 drops of lavender essential oil. And then just finish mixing in your essential oils, scoop into your mason jar, and you're all done. of the scrubs that we made today so if you tried any of these out let me know how you like them all right guys i love you have an awesome day and i hope to see you in the next video bye guys